Yo, how's it going guys? Revo here coming at you guys with a brand new video and today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. So as you guys know, I usually do reviews, squad builders, uh, trading and stuff like that related to FIFA. But today I'm going to bring you guys a video based on the new patch. Now, as you guys know, EA came out with a new patch for FIFA 19 on Monday, like uh, Tuesday morning, Tuesday morning they came out with it. So today and with that patch, they have nerfed finesse shots to pretty big they've nerfed them a lot now as you guys know before the patch people would just be setting up goals for finesse shots all game every single goal that you would score would be a finesse shot now the meta in this game has kind of changed you would have to i kind of like the patch now you build it up and you score whether it's a low driven or just a power shot through the goal or a header or whatever but now people do not set it up like a finesse shot but in this video i'm going to show you how to score using that without using the finesse shot so it's kind of the same thing let me show you guys in this video or this little clip right here that i scored so as i was playing today i noticed myself going for finesse shots the same way that i usually would whether it would be first time or just op finesse shots but doing that i discovered this new method that made it easier for me to score goals that did not involve finesse shots and it baited my opponent in the same time so i want you guys to see this clip real quick without me talking and just notice any difference. Alright, as you guys see right there, I build up the play exactly like if I was um, if I was going for a finesse shot. But instead of going for the finesse shot, I fake it and I shoot it across goal. Low driven. kind of. I went for the low driven, but it didn't do it. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that. Let's watch it one more time. So right here I have the ball with, with Lerma right here. I pass it to Fabinho. Fabinho has the ball, passes it to Neymar, and most of you guys before the patch would be going for a finesse shot right here. Am I wrong? Most of you guys would be going first time finesse shot, top corner. But if you were to try that now, the ball would go in every different direction imaginable. But now, with this method that I'm showing you guys, you will be able to score goals way easier in making your opponent believe that you're going for a finesse shot when you're in reality not. So watch it one more time. Right here, I could have gone for a finesse shot. It goes behind me. And I shoot it across goal. Now, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So, set up the goal first. There's three parts to this. The setup, the buttons you press, and then the finish. Okay? So, the setup is the same thing as, as if you were going for a finesse shot. You would just have the opponent or your player on the edge of the box, but make sure that he has a good weak foot. Now, you don't want to be going for someone like... Um, Let's say who has a two, like Salah, for example. If Salah was going for it and he hits it with his weak foot, you would not be wanting to go for that. So if you're going with it for Neymar right here, it's perfect because he has five star skills or five star weak foot. So Neymar, instead of going with it for the right foot right here, he's going to tunnel the ball through him and he's going to go with his left foot. So watch this. It has to be on his left foot. He cannot shoot it on his right foot. It has to be on his left foot. So if you had a Salah, Mohamed Salah right there, that would be perfect. But if you had him on the right side, you would need someone that's good with the right foot on the right side, if that makes any sense. So in order to do it, it's just setting the setup is exactly the same as the finesse shot. And then the movement that you need or the players that you need is someone with a good weak foot or a good strong foot in that direction, if that makes any sense. Now, I'm going to show you how to do the movement, the button movement, what you need to press. So when you pass a ball to your player on the edge of the box, all you have to do is press RB like you're going for the finesse shot, but do not press B. You need to press RB and move your left analog stick to the direction that you want to go out. So for here, for this movement, I wanted to move to the right side of this play. So I press RB and move my left analog stick to the right. I'll show you right here. RB, analog stick to the right. And from right here, you could either go with a power shot or you could just load low driven shot. Uh, power shot is just B, of course. And to load driven, all you have to do is press LB and RB at the same time and then press B. So right here, I just put it away nicely with Neymar. But that's pretty much the tutorial, guys, on how to do this new goal kind of scoring method. Uh, I know it wasn't as clear as, as I wanted it to be because it's my first tutorial like this kind of. But if you guys have any questions, comment down below. Uh, leave a like if you guys enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe for this new method. I think it's pretty useful. I've been using it in all my games so far and most of my opponents they just fall for it because they think i'm going for a finesse shot and you guys probably thought i was going for it too in that shot right there but instead i just let it go past me and tuck it in with my weak foot 
So just the things you need to remember, have someone with a good weak foot and know how to build up the play. But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Remember, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.